Uh, the death of April Walden in Norfolk two months ago was ruled a suicide. She was a member of the crew of the USS George Washington, which had suffered a cluster of suicides in recent years. But Walden's family says this one is different. They don't believe April died by suicide at all. Investigative reporter Chris Horn spoke with her sister about what she sees as too many loose ends. Chris. Too many indeed, Steph. Walden's sister points to her movements and her activities the night before she was found dead, plus suspicious behavior from the man she had been seeing in the months leading up to it. Maniki Simmons says her sister was upbeat, talking about her kids and her plans for the future. She had 14 years in with the Navy, wanted to get to 20. April Walden had gone to Walmart the night before she was found dead and purchased groceries. One of those items was bacon, and strips of bacon were sitting on her stove. Walden was found hanging from a bed sheet in her West Ocean View townhome. She had been seeing a man for a while, and he had left a mysterious note about righting his wrongs and admitted to putting her car up on a jack. Simmons says Norfolk police are not keeping the family updated and that they need to dig further into investigating that boyfriend. I won't them to find out what really happened to my sister because I know she didn't do this to herself. I want them to to really be an investigative unit, which is what they are. It is their job to to eliminate every possibility. And just where did that bed sheet come from and why was there a used condom in Walden's wastebasket? I'll have that and more on this case in my special investigation. Sailor suicide or slaying? It's coming up at 6. Chris Horn, 10 in your side.